hydrocephalus, a rare condition involving a buildup of fluid in the cavities deep within the brain. The accumulation of cerebrospinal fluid within the brain causes the cavities of ventricles to enlarge and the pressure inside the head to increase. This extra pressure on the brain can in turn result to brain damage. Hydrocephalus affects people of all age groups ranging from infants, older children, and adults. Adults who suffer from this condition may experience headaches, double vision, urinary incontinence, personality changes, cognitive difficulties, memory loss, or mental impairments. In babies, however, the condition may be seen as delayed development accompanied with a rapid increase in the size of the head. Other symptoms may include vomiting, poor feeding, sleepiness, seizures, and downward pointing of the eyes. Cases of hydrocephalus in children are mostly congenital, which means the patients were born with the condition. This could be as a result of complications arising during pregnancy or at the time of delivery. Congenital hydrocephalus can however be diagnosed before birth through routine ultrasound. Many other babies also suffer from what is medically termed acquired hydrocephalus. This develops after birth and could be as a result of neurological conditions such as head trauma, brain tumor, cyst, intraventricular hemorrhage, meningitis, or infection of the central nervous system. Hydrocephalus resulting from infections can be checked by preventing infection in the mother and infant early after birth. Routine antenatal care should be carried out regularly. Immunization to prevent the common childhood diseases such as measles, rubella, and chickenpox is also vital. The condition, if not early diagnosed, can be fatal, but with early treatment, hydrocephalus can be managed properly. Treatment for this condition involves surgery aimed at removing the excess water from the brain. This procedure, referred to as the shunt system, involves the surgical implantation of a device called a shunt into the ventricular system of the brain. This diverts the flow of cerebrospinal fluid into the abdominal cavity where it can be absorbed. Hydrocephalus can be treated and the treatment procedure is a job best reserved for a qualified brain surgeon with modern techniques to investigate and treat. If you suffer from this condition, please consult a qualified physician for medical advice.